Hey guys, it's Chloe and I'm here today with the stars of MTV's Jersey Shore, Ronnie and Sammy. Thanks so much for coming. Thanks for having yeah, us. Thanks for having us. All right, so let's just clear the air first. You guys are back together and fans are absolutely thrilled. So if I can just quickly ask you, how did that come about? Um, I think it was more that we just both took a break after Italy and Jersey and we've actually just grow, grown up as people. You know what I mean? I feel like that we had to find ourselves and I think we got to a point where it was like, can't make someone else happy if you can't please yourself. And I think at this point, we're just very happy with, with ourselves and with each other. Exactly. Sammy, you were so loyal to him um, on the last season. You know, we saw you in your bed crying at night. We saw you waiting for him to come home from the club. You partied a lot, mister. Um, you know, what do you think made you stick around for so long and not go out and find someone else? I think there's also a lot of things that not everybody gets to see. You're only seeing an hour a week, so there's a whole bunch more to the story that meets the eye. So, um, I don't know, you go in a relationship, you go through a lot of ups and downs, and at the time, you know, it was a rough spot for me, but me and mine, what nobody got to see was how good of a connection that we did have. You just saw all the negative moments and not the positive ones. So, there was a lot that kept me to stay, you know, with him and a lot of the times. And I figured at this point, it's like, if you are with somebody 24-7, you work with them, you live with them, you go out with them, no and, you don't, TV, no and you don't fight, you're crazier than I am. So <laughs> and there's something wrong with you. That's, yeah. the way, that's the way I well, look at it. So we also have some big news today to announce. Um, I heard from a little birdie that you guys were house hunting this uh, weekend, or, or, or you finally found a home. Uh, yeah, we were actually went to look for apartments this weekend, so we found something, and uh, we're going to move to New York. So. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. So are you going to be in charge of decorating? Yes. Well, yeah. I love, I love interior decorating, but Ron's good too, so he'll help me. No, I just like to do my stuff. <laughs> Are we going to see animal print in there, like we're seeing on Snooki and Jay Wow show? Um, I'm definitely unique, a little different than, you know, Nicole and Jay. Yeah, I'm not going to have animal print in the house. Sorry. <laughs> I, you know, it'll be different, completely. Different. Now, you guys living together without the cameras, is it the same Ronnie and Sammy that we see on TV? It's the complete opposite of okay. what we yeah. see on TV. No, it's a little bit because on TV, like you said, there's no. You're forced to be with each other 24-7 without computers, cell phones, or whatever. And we're, it's not like he's going to work and I'll see you tomorrow or see you later. It's like we're with each other, staring at each other all day, every day. So you see us on TV, but you, I think we're like much better when we're home, right? Yeah, because we have cell phones and computers and television. I don't know. We're just much better. We're much better. <laughs> you guys are both on Twitter a lot. And, you know, social media is really important these days. And there seems to be a feud or what seems to be a feud between Sammy and Dina right now. And um, I wanted to see if maybe you could just set the record straight. So basically, Dina bought a BMW, but you already had a BMW. And then she started saying all this stuff on Twitter. What happened? I don't know. Dina, I'm, I'm happy for Dina. She got a brand new car. It was all in good fun, my little comment. But she's like a sister, and you know how sisters like to copy off you and kind of, you know, like, not copy off you, but like, they're like sisters. They always like do what you do or copy off you, and it was just all in good fun. So I'm happy for you, Dee. I'm glad you got a new car. You know, if you want some of my style, I can lend you some. Other than that, good luck with your car. It was all in good fun. Well, listen, guys, thanks so much for coming. Um, all of our readers and viewers at Hollywood Life love you all, and we're so excited for season six of The Jersey Shore. All right, guys, so for more on what they do, follow them on Twitter because they're always tweeting. Um, <laughs> and for more on Hollywood Life, uh, news, gossip, style, beauty, and more, keep coming back to HollywoodLife.com.